Tuesday night, Revere residents showed up at polling locations by the dozens to vote on the city casino referendum. The referendum passed with approximately 63 percent of the vote, more than November's referendum, sustaining Suffolk Downs' plans to bring a casino to the community. <laughs> casino opinions were hard to ignore wherever you look. Yes, yes, yes! Let's get it built! Hardly anyone was talking about the possibility of a casino referendum not passing in Revere on Tuesday. The proposed site of the casino would be right behind us on Suffolk Downs property. $1.3 billion for a resort style casino that would bring a lot of amenities to this community. The question is, what else would it bring as a result of a vote? A lot of residents hope for jobs. Just money for like more improvements in Riviera and more jobs. Like there's never been like anything big like this in Riviera to help out with the jobs. I really think it'll help the city out. This community needs a lot more revenue. It used to have a lot of revenue when the, you know, when they had the rides on the beach and whatnot. Something's got to come in. With city approval, Mohegan Sun will now compete with Wynn Resorts for ownership of the sole Eastern Massachusetts casino license. Reporting from Revere with BUTV, I'm Ashley Davis.